Hello everyone and welcome back to Genesis Noir, a click and point adventure full of jazz music and awesome visuals in which we are uncovering a murder mystery uh, about our lover and um, apparently the guy she had a relationship with. <laughs> so we were the perpetrators. <laughs> um, this game is actually a, a very cool um, allegory to the Big Bang and the process of creation, hence the name Genesis, uh, through uh, the mystery of, of the murder itself. So last episode we found two clues, we found a cigarette butt and we found uh, the saxophone that the golden boy plays. Uh, so yeah, I think we have to keep on continuing uh, uncovering this um, these clues to find out what actually happened. So far we know uh, that maybe this guy uh, was coming from a low ground and he, due, his, due to his talent he started climbing up and gained fame and, and fortune <laughs> until he met Miss Mass. So yeah, let's see how this story continues on. So yeah, this is uh, the two clues that we already have. Well, the three clues because we have to count the bullet, which was the first one, which I think we uncovered in the second episode of the series. Last episode we uncovered the cigarette butt and uh, the saxophone. So yeah, let's let's continue and let's see what else is here. Oh, though it's so near, it's gone, huh? That could be a clue in itself. Okay, okay, okay. So last time I actually touched him and he turned a little bit golden. Oh yeah, he is. Huh, it's interesting. So I don't know if time is passing. No. I thought maybe time was passing like slower, but but it was kind of continuing. So yeah, let's uh, jump to the next. A work of art is spied from afar. Alright. A dark smudge lingers in space, pulling everything in its vicinity towards destruction. Inescapable, the black hole even absorbs the light that enters its event horizon. But rays that narrowly avoid the event horizon are bent around the massive object. Space-time curves like a lens and the beams converge on a focal point behind the black hole, forming an Einstein ring. Stand and stand at a at <laughs> sorry about that. Stand at that lonely point in space and distant sights will appear magnified as if upon a vast canvas. Which, just as a side note, uh, if you have seen Interstellar, the movie, they were the first ones to actually portray a black hole as it actually would look like in real life. <laughs> oh. So we're looking through that black hole, maybe through the lens. So what is this? This golden boy, and we can only interact with this kind of thing. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Uh, cufflinks carefully taking off before getting dirty. Ooh. So he's going to fight somebody. Maybe. Uh -huh. A button turn off while doing some heavy lifting. So he's carrying this person, maybe? Is there anything that we can see? How 
outside of the narration part. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> and I don't want to get lost. Okay, okay, okay. I'll, I'll keep going under narrative stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, set the button. We cannot interact with anything else here. So let's keep going up, I think. Okay. Suffering a star. Nothing else to interact here with. Oh, a hand. just went it's preparing something planetary ring holding the pigments of several dead worlds is that a candle of some sort the remnant, the remains of a planet crushed and ground into fine dust. A mirror. Oh, he's like, uh, this is like a painter's palette, right? This is a brush. Uh, this is like his palette. And he's making a self-portrait, maybe? Yeah, I think so, right? It's a mirror. <laughs> Talking about narcissism. <laughs> oh. Alright. Should we go here now? There's a correct path over here. And he's just painting. Painting and painting and painting and painting. Uh, I lost the weight. So it's down and then up. Uh, there he was. <laughs> oh, it's, this is more difficult than it looks like, I promise. <laughs> so sensitive yeah there is there is there is there is okay <laughs> yeah that's a self-portrait in the stars so talk about narcissism with him oh and he just found us <laughs> uh, oh, I, I thought I was uh, going to be able to touch the pen but apparently not press photo pre-autographed and well worn <laughs> we just throw it away <laughs> An ornate fountain pen used to draw flamboyant lines. The ink has run dry. Maybe this is the pen that he used to autograph his thingy. <laughs> okay. So that was the clue for this mission. Well, I don't know why I'm calling it mission. It should be more like a part of the story, right? <laughs> This puzzle piece. I like that. So we now have a pen. Oh, and we are starting to unlock the rest of the timeline, we should call it. And there's the fourth one. Alrighty. I think let's Let's just go with it, and let's do the go, go, let's go to the next one. Uh, so over here, maybe leftovers from a dead Nova. A dead end. Oh no, I went too too far.
far. And maybe this is... yeah. A search... a search like blazes, but Golden Boy is nowhere to be found. As the pull of gravity claws together clouds of interstellar atoms, tremendous pressure builds and a fire is ignited. The star is born in a halo of dust, its belly full of hydrogen, helium and lithium. Inside, fusion digests this initial meal into progressively larger, heavier, more complex elements. Growing larger and heavier with iron, the star finally collapses and bursts into a supernova unleashing a wind of rare heavy elements in its dying breath which of course this uh, process took like thousands and thousands of millions of years <laughs> so here's the self-portrait made with stars because yeah why not Ooh. Oh, we can touch this. It's a clock? It's kind of a clock, yeah. Oh, we can go forward. Can we go backwards? Oh, we can go backwards! Well, at least with the outer rings. But yeah, I think we're supposed to go forward, but... Yeah. Uh, this is the solar system? magical ancient spirit of the space Let's follow follow the prince oh little tree oh some grass and some more plants So we are hunting him. Little mice. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> There's a snake here. Be careful with that. again over here oh 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 there was something here Yeah, a little mice. 
What is it? Huh. I mean, we did run around like he told us, right? He's running around something. Maybe we have to turn around again. Oh, we cannot go further any longer. Nothing over here. like the far end so nothing over here let's see if we can find another clue somewhere else oh we run around again What is this? Oh, I cannot go. <laughs> huh. He's just running in circles. Oh wait, where am I? <laughs> I mean, we went in circles in this big rock and in the one to the right of the map, right? There's nothing else here. So maybe we have to find another rock to go around? Oh, there's a snake. Will it bite us? Nope. Oh, there's a little rabbit here. Oh, we found the, the path. <laughs> Didn't realize it. Now we're in a cave. <sighs> okay, right or left? Maybe right? Oh, I cannot go further, so left. Voluptuous curves carved into stone brings back vivid memories of the past. And why do I hear like... Yeah, we're definitely an alcoholic. We're always drinking in these memories. <laughs> She is Miss Mass herself. Ah, oh, there's where she leaves us her number.
interesting. Primitive figures painted on the stretched skin. Yeah, this is Golden Boy! <laughs> I figured it was. Alright, so she went into the water, so maybe we should go to the river. Oh, there are a lot of hands! <laughs> I didn't realize the hands. Now this is a different cave, right? No, it's the same. Oh, her footprints. Let's follow them. Whoa! There's a ton of them now. Oh, there's a tribe! Are they hunting as well? It divides in two, but they are not finding him as well. So at least one. And there she is. Of course, it was behind the leaf wall. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> I just couldn't go through. <laughs> What's the spirit? <laughs> oh no, they're going to haunt him. No! No! Disappearing? Oh no. <gasps> now we're kind of the spirits? Oh, what is going on? Yeah, we can move time again. Main 
remains of a male creature born from the ashes of a dead star, fatally sought after feminine hands wish to possess it. I guess it's time to go back. Ah, there was this was fun. The hunting piece. So yeah, I think that's another piece to the puzzle. <laughs> And I think that's going to be it for today's episode. So yeah, let's just... Ooh. Watch that and uh, yeah, I think that's it for today's episode guys. I really hope you enjoyed. And if you did, please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing and I'll see you in the next episode. See ya.